What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda. You know I like uh, coffee. I love trying some of the frou-frou stuff, too. I like my coffee black, but when I'm on the road, it's not that easy to always get coffee, especially when I'm traveling, which I did recently uh, for a for work. Um, and then sometimes at your desk, you just need coffee in the afternoon or whatever. And so here's another um, coffee packet I found. This is the Nescafe uh, Latte Caramel. So it should be really delicious. And for some of you that like your artisanal coffees, it should give you just a little bit of that uh, delicious sweetness so that you can enjoy your coffee. And because it's all dressed up and everything, you don't need to hunt out sugar and cane sugar and stevia and creamer and all that. Now, I've opened up the uh, this like pouch here and it comes with a bunch of these 20 sticks of the Nescafe coffee sticks. Now, I will say, kind of like the Starbucks Via Instance, this is really big, right? You can see how big this is and there's a lot of powder in it and uh, they're labeled right there. So. Uh, these aren't necessarily like those small lemonade sticks, lemonade powder sticks that you can carry in your purse, but you can carry these and obviously 20 of them are gonna be about this big. Now, a couple things that I noticed about this is the preparation is a little interesting. I don't know that these are generally sold in uh, the United States. And in fact, these everything on the back indicates that they this is from Malaysia. Every, the URLs are all .my and even the address here is has a Malaysian address and everything is in metric in fact they say to add it to 200 milliliters of water now the issue with that is this is not a very big cup of coffee so 200 milliliters I think is about six ounces so it's even smaller than kind of our typical eight ounce cup of coffee I'm kind of surprised given how much powder is here but I, I am guessing between the caramel caramel whatever you want to say you know your cream and then your coffee mix you've got a lot of stuff in here now I do have my Black Rifle Coffee Company mug here, and six ounces is only gonna be about this much. So I'm just gonna open it up here. I do like that it's powdered, and so you should be able to make these very, very quickly. And I'm gonna pour it. You can see there, it almost looks like an Oreo cookie. It's like, there's a lot of black and white powder. Kind of clearly separated. So what you get is, it looks very salt and peppery, right? Look at that, all right. Um, definitely has a cream odor to it. So now I'm gonna take some hot water and I'm gonna add roughly six ounces. I wanna give this coffee its best shot so I don't wanna dilute it too much. And uh, all right, so there I've got the water in there, you can see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and stir this little bad boy. And what I'm noticing is that the mixture I got on the side, you kind of have to stir a little violently to kind of get the water to creep up on the side to get all those particles, but it does seem to dissolve pretty well. Now my water here is pretty hot too. Um, I'd also say if you're filling up a thermos of hot water, you know, I like throwing in just a couple of these. You can see it steaming here. Uh, packets. I don't know if you can see it steaming, but it is. Oh yeah, there you can see it on my Black Rifle Coffee Company shirt. Um, but you know, in this case, you might have to throw in three packets into your thermos and then fill it up, especially if you have a, you know, 18, 20 ounce thermos, which a lot of people have. It smells pretty good. Um, so the one I used was the Latte Caramel. I think they're all the same. Uh, I guess I'm just a little surprised it doesn't have a little more of that rich caramel smell. It smells more like creamer, I mean, cream coffee. So let me just take a little taste here. Hopefully this isn't too hot. Wow, it's got a lot of caramel taste to it. I mean, that's for sure. So, um, so much for me not necessarily smelling it. It definitely has that, that taste, no, no doubt. So it does taste like a, I mean, it tastes like a mocha. It tastes like an instant mocha with caramel. I, I, I'm pretty impressed. This is pretty good. Um, I guess my, my, only, my only thing that I would call out is it doesn't make a lot of coffee. But in terms of taste and convenience, this is great. Yeah, now I wouldn't mind this having been uh, delivered with more English on the printing and, and whatnot, but that's the beauty of Amazon, you can find all sorts of stuff. So if you wanna check it out, have a nice cup of caramel latte, if that's your thing, 
and uh, you need the convenience of having an instant, whether it's her trip or uh, just taking it around with you or having it work or whatever, uh, this is gonna be a great thing. And it's not that expensive, so I definitely picked this up to try because um, not, not too pricey too. I'll put a link to it in the description, so check it out. Peter Brown Panda, out!